Here is an easier way to keep a track of your stock. Start by making a different table, then just click on a cell and type the formula filter. Once you do, you'll see that the next part is array. So just select your items. Next is a comma, so we will add a comma. Then include, which is going to be our stock list. Type greater than zero, close the bracket and hit enter. Do the formula again, so filter and then array. Next is a comma, and then include, which is the stock. However, this time type less or equal to zero. Close the bracket and then hit enter. And there you have it. You don't have to make this list over and over again, because now even if you change the stock, the list changes with it. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please like and subscribe.